Hey everyone, this is Jesse Van, JRV to Succeed, and today what I'm going to do is show you the the setup that I have for my computer for for my trading and anything else I decide to do on my computer. Uh, but well, what I'm actually going to show you is the change from what I currently have to what I'm going to have, um, because right now I just have my two laptops with a couple with a couple of television monitors uh, hooked up to it and it's sitting on my two end tables honestly that's that's what it's doing uh, because this area this townhome that I mean I don't have a a lot of room down here on the first floor uh, to put my my computers and about a year ago when I decided to basically do trading full-time in addition to whatever else I'm doing uh, I needed to take it off of my dining room table uh, because you know it was getting in the way of me eating you know so I moved it over here by the by the front door and I need to do something else right now uh, because I, I don't have a chair I don't have a, a desk chair or anything uh, I've been sitting on my chase I need to get off of it but I'm gonna show you everything like I said I don't, I don't have it set up right now because uh, I'm still waiting on the computer actually to come but let me go ahead and show you okay so this is how I have it set up I have my two laptops and I have um, two televisions two television monitors hooked up to it one I got from my daughter's room uh, after I got her another television and this one is from my bedroom it's actually if you anyone who's been with me been on my channel since I started about five six years ago recording videos uh, you'll remember this television because this television is the one that I actually took apart and repaired uh, after it messed up like a year after I after I got it and so for all the people that said Oh, well, you shouldn't do it that way. You know, this won't work and all this other stuff. It's still working six years later. So, there you go. What I think I'm going to do is put the chase, like, closer to the door. Um, move. I have a tabletop that I, that I got with some legs. I, I don't really need a, an actual desk with storage and all that stuff because I don't really keep a lot of stuff around, around the computer. So, I'm going to put that desktop probably where the, where the uh, chase is. And then I have my monitors and my chair and the bracket. All I'm waiting for, honestly, is the computer. Uh, so I'm still waiting on that to come in. I'm going to come back once it's actually uh, all set up. And then we'll just go over. I'll just show you what I have at that point. Okay, so I got everything set up. Everything came in. I got everything hooked up. And my little area is exceedingly more crowded now, except for like right here where the computer is. But I guess I accomplished what I set out to do, which was to get a you know a better computer for my trading. Uh, so let me let me show you everything. Okay, so let me stand up. All right, so first of all. You know, I got I got a chair, got a little mat to put down on this this uh, wood laminate stuff that they have down here, and I have the computer. So when I when I initially started this process, what I what I planned on doing was building my own computer because the uh, I built my my last desktop. Uh, I did it because one I, I I just wanted to be able to say that I built my own computer. And two, as I looked around everywhere, the prices were, you know, were a lot higher than what it would be if I built my own. So I got a, a tower and it had the motherboard and the processor already in it. But everything after that, the peripherals and everything I, I put in myself. So, but this time when I started doing it, I was looking around and I was comparing it to what, what these uh, custom builders do. The custom builders for like trading or, or graphics, uh, because that's what I was basically looking for. Uh, and those kind of fit the same parameters as far as what I would need. Uh, but I was looking around through them and compared to, to what it was going to cost me to actually build a computer. Now I'm not talking about the, 
the monitors or the desk or the chair or any of that other ancillary stuff. I'm, I'm just talking about the straight computer because I knew that other stuff was going to cost me extra anyway. But on the computer, it was going to run me somewhere around $1,700, $1,800 to get everything that I wanted in it. And it was going to cost about 2000 I think every time I built it through one of the, the little custom builders that they had, it, it ended up around $2,000 right at two thousand dollars or a little bit over two thousand dollars so so i figured that's what i was going to be spending okay. is about two thousand dollars or so and if it was going to cost me eighteen hundred seventeen eighteen hundred to do it myself why not just let one of them do it and save myself the headache of, of taking time off from from uh from doing what i'm doing on my my regular computer at the time or waiting to the weekend and trying to get it all in the weekend and all the stuff like that. It, I just didn't, it saved me time. That $300 was worth me not having to do it, basically. So, so I started comparing which one I wanted to go with, which one of these custom builders I wanted to go with. And when I, when I did that, what I saw is every last one of them were going to take three weeks or more. Three weeks or more to get my computer to me, which was crazy. I'm, I'm going to give you $2,000 right now and you're going to tell me three weeks later is when I'm going to get the product to see if it's, if it's actually worth it. I, I, don't, I don't think so. So, so. But I didn't really have any other choice. Either, either do that or build it myself and take however long it's going to take for me to get all the parts in and, and build it myself. So what I decided to look at is to go to one of the, I guess, big box uh, people it's like a Dell or, or something like that. Um, so I checked them out and it actually turned out that uh, getting a, a, an Alienware computer which an Alienware computer which is what I actually got through Dell came out to like $2,100 so it was maybe it was right around the price of, of what it would have been if I got it built now I didn't have all the you know the the different lights and all this other stuff in it you know it didn't have all that stuff in it uh, which that looks cool but it wasn't anything that I really needed so I ended up going there so let me show you the com the uh, computer setup that I have and, and what I'll do is I'll list in the in the description exactly what I got in my computer in case somebody else wants to get the same thing or wants to you know adjust it for what they want to get or, or something like that I'll put in there what I what I actually got in it okay but Here you go. We have the computer down here. We got three monitors, which I got from Amazon. Let me log in. So here we go. We got we got your we got three monitors, three they're 24 inch, three 24 inch monitors. I have my um, Logitech 922. I guess that was supposed to be like the best webcam out right now. Uh, I did the uh, three stand mount. Uh, I put a one by four um, piece of wood that I bought at Lowe's and had them cut it. It was a four foot piece. I had them cut it in half and I got one on the top, one on the bottom. I didn't paint the one on the bottom, but I have that up there to to brace it so that it doesn't ruin the desk, the this uh desk that I got from IKEA which was, you know, is doesn't really seem really sturdy. It's not it's not a heavyweight desk or anything, so I want to to brace it. Okay, and that's basically it. Uh, I think I, I got a pretty good processor. I got a good video graphics card. Uh, the uh, everything is pretty good. I mean, it's a pretty good deal for what I got. I believe anyway. Uh, when I looked at what it was gonna cost me to build it with the stuff I wanted in it, or what it was gonna cost to get it custom built at one of these custom builders, which I, I'm I'm not gonna name because I didn't use them. So um, when I looked at all this stuff, it actually you know it actually wasn't that bad of a deal just getting it from Dell for for twenty one hundred dollars and. And then the rest of the stuff, you know, that cost me a little bit more, you know. But um, that's it. If you like this video, feel feel free to to like it, share it, 
subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. I, I do see that my subscriptions have been going up. I appreciate it. Uh, keep subscribing. Uh, I can use all of them that I can get. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask them down in the in the comments section. Um, and like I always say, I, I will answer anything unless it's just negative, just to be negative. I, I really don't answer those. And they probably won't stay on my uh, thing. I don't care about somebody putting something negative or saying, hey, you shouldn't have did this or you, you should do this the next time or something. I don't mind that. But if you're just being negative, just with no constructive uh, input at the at the end of it, then I, I don't want it. I don't want to see it. So you have a great day and a better tomorrow.